Hello and hi everyone. Today I want to share about the life cycle assessment of durian. This video content consists of four parts which is the introduction of durian, the life cycle of durian, the impact, and the last one is the conclusion. So, let's move into the introduction. Durian is eatable fruit from the durio species. Durian also known as king of fruit because of the strong aroma and unique flavor. Durian has green to greenish bronze skin color and yellow or white flesh. The word of duri, taken from Malay, which is translate is as a thorn that show the durian characteristic. Quick question, where and which country produce durian? Most of the durian is produced from Southeast Asia, such as Thailand, Indonesia, Malaysia, and the Philippines. Among these four countries, Thailand was the biggest producer and export durian, estimating around 90% of global export to China. This picture is an example of a durian. Each of these durians has their own characteristic, which the skin color, size, and color flesh. Let's move on to the life cycle of durian. The life cycle of durian consists of five stages, which is Plantation Packaging Transportation and Distribution Consumer And End of Product So, the first stage is a plantation. This stage focuses on growing, taking care of, and harvesting durian. This includes seeding and planting, nursery and stem grafting, land clearing, and harvesting. The second stage is packaging. Packaging durian often use when exporting durian to other countries. Freeze-dried packaging waste the focus in this video. Here the process, packaging. After the durian arrives in the packaging area, the cleaning process takes place by using water to make sure there is no unwanted material involved in the packaging. After that, cutting to open durian and slice flesh durian into small piece. Next phase is putting the durian inside the machine to remove moisture. The last process is packaging using a vacuum sealer to prevent the air inside the package. Stage number three, distribution and transportation. There are two ways of transportation, ocean and land. Normally, when exporting durian to other countries, durian from packaging process will be transported by lorries and cargo ship to reach the market. Other ways are straight away transporting from packaging, transporting using lorries or vehicle to the market. The fourth stage is consumer, which refers to us the people who consume durian. And the last stage is the end of the product. Normally, most of the plastic packaging is single-use plastic means. It will end up in a landfill. However, skin and seed durian will end up in composting area or landfill. But composting is highly depending on the consumer either their compost or not. So, what will be the impact of the durian life cycle? Firstly, we will look at the economy impact. The impact to the economy is the country might be loss come income related to tax land because of illegal durian cultivation. The profit that came from selling durian is very high so people will try to do the illegal durian cultivation. The second impact to the social is loss of water resources. 
people who highly depend on rivers as water resources will be affected. Because of sedimentation from the land clearing pollutes the water. Loss of food sources, especially fish. Because of sedimentation affecting the spawning ground. Impact on environment. The first impact is river water pollution. Sediment and turbidity water can happen due to the land clearing activities. For durian plantations entering the river. The second impact is the loss of forest, which refers to illegal durian cultivation toward reserve forest. The third impact is loss of habitat. Aquatic animals and other animals may lose their spawning ground and habitat because of land clearing. This is also bad for durian plantations because land clearing will cause a great impact on the pollination of durian. This is also bad for durian plantations because land clearing will cause a great impact on the pollination of durian. So, without will animals, durian production will reduce. So, we reach our conclusion. Manufacturing and packaging durian must use biodegradable plastic to avoid the further problem to the environment. The plastic waste will take a long time to degrade in. When it degrades to microplastic, it can move to our food chain and affect our health. Apart from that, consumer and manufacturing also need to practice composting or try to convert waste to energy. And finally, sustainable agriculture needs to be practiced to minimize the impact of agriculture activities. All of this will contribute to the sustainable development goal, which is responsible consumption and production, climate action and life on land. With the implementation of these strategies, we can reduce the plastic problem, greenhouse gases, wildlife protection and protect the natural resources. Thank you for watching.